Alrighty, we're gonna be playing Dragon Age Inquisition. Mostly because I have a fucking idea what to play. So, I never beat this game actually, so I kinda want to. I figure the best way to beat it is by playing the game while also recording it. And I had a bunch of different characters in the game and I just never fucking got through it. Um. Fuck. What do I wanna be? Uh, elf. So, we're gonna play this on the hardest difficulty we can. Because I'm, I'm a fucking retard and I like putting myself in very terrible situations. Uh, normally I play as an archer so I can fuck up dragons. But I think I want to do mage this time. But then I have to change abilities based on what I'm doing. <laughs> we'll do mage. Well, but then I can't bring Solos with me. Well, I can, but I mean, I want to do mages. We'll do archer. Uh, and obviously we're going to do a Nightmare Mode. Because it's a fucking psychopath. I don't know what that fourth card is. I'm assuming it has something to do with my Dragon's Keep thing, but I, I don't pay attention enough. Oh, and this is the Dragon Keep thing. Uh, no, I don't, I don't even know what's in my Dragon Keep. We'll just do a default world save. I don't know if that changes the way you interact with certain characters from the other games. I can't remember completely if they changes anything at all. If it doesn't, then fuck it, you know? I win. But if it does, then I'm, I'm retarded. And I'm probably probably don't deserve to live. Wish you would really wish these loading screens were quick. Uh, if you find equipment you can't wear, one of your party members might be able to use it. See, this never happens because most of the time I'm doing all the work myself. Except Cassandra. She somehow is able to hold everything. I mean everything. But I'm gonna make sure, I'm thinking I'm gonna do Cassandra. I'm not gonna do Solo so I can't have him towards the end of the game. So I'm gonna do Cassandra. Uh, wait, if I wasn't gonna use Solus, then I had to use Mage. Uh. Oh, no wait, I already picked Mage, didn't I? Or did I pick Archer? Archer. I don't know which one I picked. We'll figure out. We'll go from there. See, if I, if I don't have, if I'm not a mage, I'm an archer, then I'm going to keep souls to the end, take all the shit from him at the end, and then get rid of him. And then just switch over, what's your face? I can't remember what that black lady is. Switch her over to that. If I am an archer, which I'm assuming I'm, a, I'm, I'm, a, I'm an archer because of the gear I'm wearing. I don't actually know if that changes at all. Uh, that's, there isn't really a lot that I want to change, except like, like, it's a very weird face. It's complexion. Uh, eye color. Um, the hair is important. This man bun thing is not gonna work out. So we're gonna look for something else. I've never been a big fan of their hairs as a whole. Elf hair is kind of weird looking. I should have been a girl. Yeah, I should have been a girl. It's too late now. Or is it? Yo, know boys, we're gonna go back. I'm sorry, we're gonna have to load the screens. But I'm gonna be a girl, I'm gonna be a mage. I think that's the best bet, honestly. Uh, why does that shake? The controller shake every time that explodes. It's so weird. Um, Maybe if I want to be an elf girl or a human girl, though, this is, this, this is where it's hard because I don't want to be a dwarf, obviously. I don't want to be a Quinari because they they look weird. It's mean to say, but they look weird. Uh, I remember if elves have a passive increases the bonus to range defense. 
bonus ability point at the start of the game. That sounds really good. Now, see, the problem with this is, though, right? To be a mage, right? It's going to require me to put the shields up as well. It's going to be an automatic thing. But if I do an archer, I can fucking, like, annihilate people with, like, a few hits. It's a very hard one. I'm gonna be a mage just because I like fire. And obviously, my ear mode. What's up with the owl? It's, I guess it's just different for each one. I don't know. Alright. Now we can actually get into the game. Now we can do this. Now we're gonna be cool. Talk often to your companion. Uh, I don't know what that, what that, what that means. I don't, I don't talk to the companions at all. I don't think I played Dragon Age correctly, honestly. I'm always playing to try and get like the most out of it, like gear-wise and EXP-wise. Trying to finish, I'm trying to 100% everything. And there are people here trying to listen to comments by people, and I'm just looking like an asshole. Can I not? Do I have to watch them stand up every time? All right, let's customize you. You, you, you got a, you got more of like a, like a, like a lolly face. You got more like a dominant like female face. Let's see. Okay, so I'm gonna say that the only good face you got is this one. So we're gonna go with that. Uh, we're gonna make you a little bit tanned. We're gonna make you a ghost, honestly. Yeah, you're gonna be a pale ghost, bitch. You're a pale ghost now. Oh! Now let's see if we can make you a little bit younger. I like the freckles. I'll go with that. Good eyes, good eyes, good eyes. Okay. What I should have did was download the mod to get better hairstyles. But it's too, it's too late now. It's way too late. It requires a lot of work. Uh, I like it. But she's got a big ass forehead, so that's it's gonna take away from it. Um, none of those, none of those will work because of her forehead. So, I don't like short hair either. I mean, the hair is gonna be always short, but. Hmm. This might work. As long as the job gets done, I don't care about the rest. You leave me no choice! As long as the job gets done, I don't care about the rest. That's such a big change. As long as the job gets done, I don't care about the rest. It's a huge change. I just okay. hope I can help. Alright. Um Her ears are oh wait, no. Wait, never mind. Let's let's I never see your ears because she's gonna wear a helmet anyway, but you know. People are weird. I'm weird. <laughs> Dumbo. No put in there. Why are her ears so far back? Like or or have I never known that ears are this far back? I, I don't know, maybe I'm weird. I think I might be just might just be weird. Um she's got a nice like like swollen face chiseled thing. I'm just trying to figure out how I'm gonna fix this forehead. Because, um, that forehead a monster. Um, can I fix her forehead? That is the question. And I don't believe I can. So, she's just going to have a forehead. I'm, I'm assuming the scars are supposed to be somewhere that I can't see. Like, come right now, you see any scars? You see scars? You don't see any scars, right? I don't see any fucking scars. Okay. Um, eye color, eye shadow. We're gonna, we're gonna go. I can't see her eye shadow. I don't. Ah, there you go. Her under eye, under brow. 
just gonna be all black. Like, like this. Let's not even. Let's not even act like we don't know what we're doing here. We're going. We're going full black at this. It's gonna be. It's gonna be a dark bitch. Look at that shit. Fucking evil looking bitch. Um, eyelash colors. Uh, I'm hoping black. Eyeliner color. <laughs> black. Eyeliner intensity. Fucking layer it. There you go. All right, I'm gonna give her some nice blush. Look at this. Look at this sweet blush. Look at that. Mm -hmm. If we give her a really black blush, it would be really interesting. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna blend in with her skin. See that? She's got really good skin there. Like half her skin is like red, the other skin is white. Doesn't matter. Let me just turn that shit up. There we go. Look at that face. It's a gorgeous face. All right, now. I'm gonna give her some fucking, I'm gonna give her some black lipstick here. I'm gonna intensify the shit out of that. Her lip liner, black. The shine? Ugh. Let's bring the shine down, actually. This is the embodiment of my wife. If I had one. If anyone loved me. Which they don't. Oh no, I'm done. I'm done. I wanted to accept the changes. Uh... Oh, we're just gonna be a bitch. We're gonna go Zerna. Just to fuck with someone. Obviously, this bitch is gonna be a, di a dyke. Like, she looks like a dyke. I'm gonna make her a dyke. Honestly, I don't think it was ever explained exactly how you ended up in this area. Like, I know you were around for the explosion, but it's like, why were you even in the area to begin with? secret. She can't. She can't close them. That's a weird lag. Okay. It's cool. Like, my FPS dropped to, like, fucking 45. For some odd reason. I don't think I've ever had an FPS lag in this game either. It's really weird. Look at my bitch though. <laughs> now that I think about it, I should have given her the other voice if I was gonna make her a dyke. Now she's like got all this like darkness to her, and then as soon as she talks, gonna be like, I'm a cherry little girl and I love you. Tell me why we shouldn't kill you now. Because I'm sexy. The conclave is destroyed. Everyone who attended is dead. Except for mm. you. That's horrible. What do you mean everyone is dead? Explain this. I can't. What do you mean you can't? I don't know what that is, or how it got there. You're lying! We need her, Cassandra. I love Liliana. Um, I, I would say I'm confused, honestly. I don't understand. Do you remember what happened? How this began? I remember... running. Things were chasing me, and then... A woman? A woman? She reached out to me, but then... Go to the forward camp, Liliana. 
I will take her to the rift. Also, if she's the one creating the rift, would it really be smart to bring her to it? What did happen? Right? <laughs> that makes sense. It will be easy to, to show. show you. I don't remember anything about mage gameplay either, so if I'm fucking up on it throughout the play, don't, don't laugh at me. I have no clue. I don't think I've ever played a mage. I've always either played an archer or a rogue. Just for that extra, like, crit damage. We call it the Breach. It's a massive rift into the world of demons that grows larger with each passing hour. It's not the only such rift, just the largest. All were caused by the explosion at the Conclave. An explosion can do that? This one did. Unless we act, the breach may grow until it swallows the world. Each time the breach expands, your mark spreads, and it is killing you. It may be the key to stopping this. My biggest problem is like, you knew it was killing her. Why did you assume that she was one who did? Why would she do something to kill herself? I understand. Then I'll do what I can, whatever it takes. They have decided your guilt. They need it. The people of Haven mourn our most holy the guy is divine like, justice. He just wants my deed. Head of the Chantry. The conclave was hers. It was a chance for peace between mages and Templars. It's really weird that it's she taken a long time to load in. Together. Or loading in now as I want. But I've seen it happen a lot. But I never understand why it is the case that it does. Like just like slow movement here. I think it's just the shadow effects that's causing it to have to do all that, but it's weird. I'll probably just turn shadow effects off anyway. There will be a trial. I can promise no more. Come. It is not far. Where are you taking me? Your mark must be tested on something smaller than the breach. Alright, so first things first, rob everything you can. If there's anything here to rob, which there probably is not. I think I'm gonna have a really nice Actually, do I have ability points yet, or will it not let me check? It won't let me check. Of course not. Fucking cunts. Why did I think this was like I took the pa the back passage and I had to fight my way there? It's really dark. Does this game look dark to you? Uh, uh, I don't know. This could just be me. I, why can't I loot these bodies? God, this game is so fucking gorgeous. Pulses are coming faster now. The larger the breach grows, the more rifts appear, the more demons we face. How did I survive the blast? They said you stepped out of a rift, then fell unconscious. They say a woman was in the rift behind you. No one knows. Fuck. I had the controller right next to my nads. Stay behind me. Is that a staff?
Oh, right, I forgot it's on madness mode. So. Don't worry about the laughing. Just keep him. Okay, this mob is not dying very quickly. It's madness mode, though. It's over. Drop your weapon. Now! If you're going to lead me through a demon-infested valley, you'll have to trust me. Give me one reason to trust you. Because my life is on the line. <sighs> you're right. Why was that not your first thought? You need a staff. But you should have one. I cannot protect you. Oh, I guess I should have said you don't need a staff. Maybe she would have approved of me. I should remember you agreed to come willingly. Uh... Take these potions. Maker knows what we will face. Where are all your... Oh, the side button. Have I, I never played in a controller before? Am I just retarded? We are on our own. I feel like there was loot back here at some point, and I'm just not seeing it now. At least crafting material or turn in resources. Also, a good hint for all the people who don't who don't play the game like fully out. There's a lot of shit in this first map that's just hidden around everywhere. Like if you if you can search everything. And I mean everything. The only one corner unchecked. Uh I'm not going to call. It's not pretty. And I want to see her face. Alright. There! Watch out! If we flank them, we may gain the advantage. What I gotta do is make him run all the way up here, right? And then... And make him run away back. Oh, wait, he can jump? What the fuck? I feel like those are supposed to hit them, and for some reason I'm too close so it doesn't hit them, I guess. Oh well. Let's see if we can find some more loot. Um, um, um. Ooh, gold. I think there was gold up there that I had passed up too because they made me jump all the way fuck down here! That was a weird <laughs> glitch. La 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 la. Um, Turn-ins give us uh, points towards our thingy majigger so we can get more stuff though. So, gotta make sure we get everything and try to clear every quest as well. I need one from a distance. I thought those things always have shields though. I don't think they have shields now. These things can have no fucking things, man. Jesus Christ. Here in a bit I'm gonna to switch to play of uh, the torchlight frontier. wondering how that game's gonna turn out so hopefully when I play it it's actually something good it's the alpha beta so it's not anything like major major in the game but it's like oh yeah maybe there will be some really good content and I will believe that Torchlight isn't dead 
Because honestly, I thought ah, Torchlight was dead. From the uh, as you can see, I've gone out very far. I feel like there's only really good stuff when I when I have Solus and the other guy. How do I forget Varric's name? I'm gonna ask. All right, let's go. I can't remember if I get my fourth degree flash or not. Uh, how do I? How do I change targets again? Focus. Some loot, give me the loot, there's some money. And then get the iron, the elf fruit. I think we're it's getting up close to the rift. Yeah, okay, you we're can good. hear the fighting. Who's fighting? You'll mm. see soon. We must help them. Like I was like, oh, are there cool people fighting over there? People that we haven't met before? People we know. It's like, oh, it's definitely people you know. All right, and then we just. Oh, I fucked up. There we go. I don't know how long her taunt lasts. I thought it was on for everyone, but I guess not. Should be able to check my character after this and get my free ability point. Good for something. Whatever magic opened the breach in the sky also placed that mark upon your hand. I theorized the mark might be able to close the rifts that have opened in the breach's wake. And it seems I was correct. Meaning it could also close the breach itself. Possibly. It seems you hold the key to our salvation. Yeah, so that's won't fuck me because I'm not an elf. Here I thought Forgot about that part. Deep and forever. And then Varric, the sex Varric book writer. Tetris. Rogue, 
storyteller, but occasionally unwelcome tag along. Are you at the Chantry, or...? <laughs> Was that a serious question? <laughs> Technically, I'm a prisoner, just like you. I brought you here to tell your story to the Divine. Clearly, that is no longer necessary. Yet, here I am. Lucky for you, considering current events. That's a nice crossbow you have there. Ah, isn't she? Bianca and I have been through a lot together. You named your crossbow Bianca? Of course. And she'll be great company in the valley. Absolutely not. Your help is appreciated, Varric, but... Have you been in the valley lately, Seeker? Your soldiers aren't in control anymore. You need me. Ugh. My name is Solus, if there are to be introductions. I am pleased to see you still live. I realize how ugly and creepy I kept he looks. That mark from killing you while you slept. Then I owe you my thanks. Thank me if we manage to close the breach without killing you in the process. Cassandra, you should know. The magic involved here is unlike any I've seen. Your prisoner is a mage, but I find it difficult to imagine any mage having such power. Understood. We must get to the forward camp quickly. Ah, uh, I keep forgetting that people do not well, like the mages. Beyond well, the Templar style. Either way, I'm gonna stop it here, and we're gonna start back up. This way. When I come back, oh, right. when I come back, we're gonna, we're gonna try and get some more done. Well, I shall see you guys in a bit. Bye bye.